Hello, greetings and salutations. Welcome back to Buffalo Fireside Chats. I hope you guys are having a great day. Let's get into it. The reason why you clicked on this video, 1792 Small Batch Bourbon. Named in honor of the year Kentucky joined the United States, 1792 Small Batch Bourbon is made from a marriage of a few select barrels carefully chosen by our master distiller. This refined bourbon elevates Kentucky distilling to exceptional new heights. Celebrated by whiskey connoisseurs worldwide, the subtleties of 1792 make it incomparably brash and bold, yet smooth and balanced. Now on to the description. Yes, on to the description. Um, <laughs> let's see where we're at with this puppy. Okay, yeah. I This is really pleasant on the nose. Like, really. I don't get any of that ethanol, rubbing alcohol, and n n none of that stuff. I just get, it's sweet. It's sweet on the nose. So sweet. Yeah. Okay. Caramel first. Sweet. Immediately after, pepper takes over. The spice kicks in. I feel that moving all around. Oh, yeah. Ooh, baby. Um, yeah, and it finishes with Vanilla. This is actually, um, usually when I, I pick up a lot of vanilla in, in these bourbons, it's common, you know, but this is actually the latest in a sip where the vanilla kicks in, if that makes sense. Maybe it's just my, uh, maybe it's just me, you know, but I get vanilla. I get vanilla at the end. I really do. Wow. This is delicious. Thank you, sir, for uh, this lovely addition to my bourbon collection. Um, let's get into the official cheers of the week. The cheers of the week goes out to anybody affected by Hurricane Ian. You know, you guys have been through hell down there. Um, and I've seen the videos, I've seen the pictures, and it's absolutely horrible. Some of you guys have lost everything. Know that we are with you up here in Buffalo. We're thinking of you guys. Um, and this cheers goes to you. Hang in there, stay tough, be resilient, and you guys are going to get through this. That's good bourbon, by the way. Very, very good bourbon. Oh, my God. Yeah, this is going to be gone very, very soon. Um, and I did promise you, Jake, by the way, that we would do this together and, and open it together. But guess what? I didn't. But I will definitely save some for you, of course, because you were the nice gentleman that gave me this bottle of bourbon. Great. Oh, yeah, baby. So on the Eyeless front, many of you guys that have subscribed to this channel are invested in Eyeless. And guess what? There's a lot that's coming out, especially with the, uh, the whole... Um, share lockup thing, and I've I've been asked some questions about it. Um, what does it mean? How are we going to be able to lock up shares? I'm going to call TD Ameritrade on Monday and get some of the answers that you're looking for, and I'm going to sort of put together a how-to video um, if you choose to lock up your shares. I'm not trying to sway you one way or the other. I'm going to lock up about 15% of my shares, but as I receive more details from the company, I may want to lock up more, or I may want to lock up less. They have more um, ability to, to uh, sell my shares when I want within that 24 months. So, you know, I, it's, it's a, this is a learning curve for me. I have never locked up shares before. So that's that. Also, we are almost at 300 subscribers. So if you haven't subscribed yet, please hit the like button, hit the, share this and, and hit the subscribe button. And if you don't like me that much, well, just turn off the alerts. I'm just kidding. I want you to get these videos so we could do more bourbons. Actually, the one on deck is from Jordan Hugga. Thanks to you, Jord, for um, the bottle of, well, I'm not going to say what it is yet. You just have to tune in to find out next time. Remember, there is more that binds us than, bleh, bleh. there's more that binds us than breaks us. I buzzed my head and I think I took my brain out. Have a great night. <laughs>